graduates. It's hard to believe that we began our journey at Thorn Ridge High School together four years ago. You were bright-eyed freshmen, excited about what high school had to offer. It was my first year as principal here at Thorn Ridge, and I knew that you were going to do great things. You have been accepted into colleges and universities throughout the country. You have become sectional champions in sports. You've illustrated your talents in the arts, and you have completed countless hours of community service. You've certainly done us proud. Things seem very fragile and uncertain due to the current world health crisis, but you have built a strong foundation for yourselves over the past four years. Each morning, you would hear my message about staying focused, and you have done just that, class of 2020. You followed one course until you reached success. That success is graduation. Continue to be focused in life. Learn to find the positive in any situation, no matter how grim it might look. You have survived a pandemic and, of course, our infrequent power outages here at the school. I know that you will handle adulthood with style and grace. High school graduation is just the beginning. It's just the beginning of the rest of your lives. You are the captains of your own ship. And I know that the class of 2020 is destined to set sail for nothing but greatness. So as you start this journey of the rest of your lives, just know that you are Falcons for life and we are TR. Congratulations, class of 2020. seniors, I am here today to celebrate the graduation of the class of 2020 from Don Ridge High School. I am proud to be part of this online ceremony as the of Don Ridge High School. Congrats class of 2020, you've done it. 
Despite all the obstacles that you have been through, you finally here at the final stage of your high school career. But it isn't over just yet. Take this moment to celebrate all that you have achieved. I know that this isn't the graduation ceremony that you thought you would have. But I know that every single one of you will go on to do great things and look back in this moment with pride that you got through this. I know that right now is a very scary and unknown time period of your lives, but this is not the end. We will get through this. You will forever remember this moment and all the memories that came before this. Like the loss and gains of friends, the tears you've cried, the smiles you've worn, and the experiences you've gained throughout your high school life. However, we haven't we haven't got to this point on our own. I have to thank the teachers and staff of Thorn Ridge High School. They have been there for us since day one, pushing us and supporting us to do our best. They have pushing, they have supported us on the right path since the day one. And if we want, they've never hesitated to sit us down and say, you could do better than not. I also have to thank the parents and guardians. They pushed us to succeed and supported our dreams. Class 2020, your hard work throughout your four years of high school have accumulated to this one single moment. Congrats. Good day. My name is Nina Graham, president of Thorn Township High School District 205. Thank you for allowing me to share this auspicious occasion with you and your family. As president of the Board of Education, it gives me great pride to participate in commencement exercises every year. Participating in the graduation is one of the perks of the job of the members of the Board of Education truly enjoy. To reach this day, the graduates have had the support of their loving families. Some of them love you so much, they are probably watching this virtual graduation in cities across the country. I congratulate the parents who have sacrificed to make this moment possible. It is a glorious day when your child graduates from high school. Now, life begins. And there may be a little extra room in the house for the next few years. I know the members of the class of 2020 would join me in thanking you for your love and support. Most of all, I congratulate the members of the class of 2020. You worked hard to reach this milestone. You are leaving Thorn Township High School District with lifelong friends and fond memories. You will always remember how much you enjoyed the cafeteria food and the district's morning mantra of, make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. However, seriously, the last half of your senior year was unprecedented. No one foresaw the devastation of COVID-19 and the impact it had on our school year. This is not what we hope for. The community and our great country are hurting along with you. Nevertheless, through the ashes of despair, I see the rise in a great phoenix among you. I see the potential of finding a cure for many diseases that plague our world. You are the next generation of the professionals that will develop life-saving medicines, cutting-edge technology, an array of other successes too numerous to mention. We encourage you, our phenomenal District 205 graduates, climb the mountain to embrace your challenges so you can see the world and the world will see you. Someone once said, don't tell me the sky is the limit when there are footprints on the moon. Continue your mission to develop and protect a moral sensibility and demonstrate the character to apply it. Follow your dreams. On behalf of my fellow board members, Mrs. Annette Whittington, Mrs. Almeta Bassa Moody, Mr. Ray Banks, Mr. Albert Butler, Mrs. Letitia Cruz, and Mrs. Bernadette Lawrence, we wish you the best. Stay in touch with your friends. Love your family. Treat this day as a step toward a lifetime of learning and go forward with confidence. May God bless you. Well, we did it. 
we all accomplished one of the major early milestones of our lives, high school graduation. This is a major step in our journey and it should be recognized for its immense significance. It is an act not only of personal commitment, but also one of pride. We all worked hard to get to this day and our work was not in vain. It began in 2016, our freshman year. We came in ready to see what high school was truly about. We all saw high school from a different perspective, be it sports, fine arts, community service, and even academics. However, one thing we all had in common was that we were ready to grow up. Then came sophomore year, and I'd be lying if I said we weren't ready to graduate. <laughs> Classes got harder, the stakes became more apparent, and we began finding ourselves. Junior year brought our first few advanced courses. It brought the SAT, and it was our first year of becoming upperclassmen. And finally, senior year. The amount of challenges we faced this year surpasses all of the other years combined, but we made it. A high school diploma is a wonderful tool in this world, one that opens many doors of opportunity for anyone who is lucky enough to have one. But that wonderful diploma is not an end goal in itself. It is instead a part of a larger journey of life. Wherever your future takes you, let it take you somewhere that you will thrive. Life is a journey, and all accomplishments we achieve during its course should be taken as starting points for future achievements. Our graduation should serve as a launching point, projecting us to wherever our futures are meant to take us. Whether we land ourselves a career, take up a trade, or continue our education at college or a vocational technical school. To the parents and guardians that encouraged and prayed for us, thank you. Without you, we wouldn't be the resilient leaders we are today. Your love and guidance offered discipline at the perfect times in our lives. To the teachers who understood, you transformed the classroom into a place where we could retain you fought for us when we needed it, and you put us in check when we started losing our way. To the activity sponsors that fostered and developed our passions, skills, and future careers. When we didn't know who or what we were going to be, you came in and helped us reach for the stars. But before we can begin to reach for the stars, there is one more important task we must encounter. That task is the virus. Now, most of you may think I'm talking about COVID-19, but I'm actually talking about something more aggressive, more persistent, more impressionable, one that will bring you to your most vulnerable stage. Now, this virus represents something more than physical characteristics. It represents that person that told you that you wouldn't graduate. It represents the voice of doubt and fear in the back of your mind. It even represents a worldwide pandemic. This virus is anything that will try to stop you from achieving success. And the moment you give up and you give in is the moment you catch the virus. The class of 2020 is strong. We are perseverant. And because of our amazing high school, we have the tools and resources to fight off this virus. So I challenge you, the 2020 senior graduating in your living room. I challenge you to fight the virus. When someone tells you that you wanna accomplish something, work 10 times harder and accomplish it. When the voice of fear or doubt enters your mind, Understand that it's exactly your mind and you can change it. And finally, when something completely out of your control threatens your hard work and accomplishments, 
find a new way and get it done. This is our year and it will forever be remembered. So congrats to us and remember to keep advancing forward no matter what. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Good afternoon, administration, teachers, family, friends, and class of 2020. Four years ago, we walked in high school not knowing what the future would hold. Now, we're walking out with a plan to achieve success. It only seemed like yesterday when we were little freshmen lost in the hallways of the school. Now we're seniors ready to graduate and open a new chapter in our lives. It was once said by Ray Gofford. There are two types of people who will tell you you cannot make a difference in this world. Those who are afraid to try and those who are afraid you will succeed. I am glad to say that every single one of you did not let such a person influence you. Sadly, we cannot experience graduation the way we're supposed to due to this pandemic. I advise that we all forget about the negative aspect for now and savor this very moment because this is a huge milestone in our lives. I remember feeling scared about what high school was gonna be like. Looking back, high school was, was a great experience. From freshman year, when I used to struggle to open my locker, to sophomore year, which was a blur, to junior year, which was epic and nerve wracking, to senior year, which was somewhat disappointing, I still had an amazing time. Some of my favorite memories of high school were having fun during prep rallies, going to school events, complaining to teachers about the amount of work we were receiving, annoying some teachers and classmates, and laughing with close friends. High school taught me a lot. It taught me to be mature and think about others. It also made me learn that I'm never alone in any situation and that I have others to lean on. It made me independent, but also made me realize I could hacks for help. Some people made an impact on my life in high school. First, I would like to thank my parents. My parents have been my biggest supporters. They encouraged me to keep pushing and use my failure as a lesson. Every morning before going to school, my mom would always pray for me. I would tell her whenever I have a test or an exam so I can receive her prayers. My parents tell me to keep in mind where I came from and my background. They made sacrifices for me and made me who I am today. I appreciate you guys. Next, I would like to thank a teacher who I can boldly say had an impact in my life. I want to thank Ms. Steve Barra for listening to me and giving me advice. There was a point in my life where I was unsure about my future. Mr. Ibarra advised me to stop worrying and take things one step at a time. I am grateful to have had you as my teacher. I also want to thank every teacher at Orange High School for all they do. Because of you guys, we're here today. I want to encourage you all to make a difference in this world. Do not belittle yourself based on what others have to say about you. I want every one of you to reach your full potential. I know that some of us are going to be the next doctors, nurses, lawyers, teachers, basketball players, and much more. People who want success chase after it. Graduation is not a little deal. It is a great landmark in life and should be taken seriously. Some people do not get to experience what you're experiencing right now. We should all be proud of ourselves. Congratulations, class of 2020. The George S. McNally Sportsmanship Award honors Mr. McNally for his over 30 years of service on the Thornton Township High School District 205 Board of Education. It is awarded to the graduate who exudes the TR spirit by demonstrating all the qualities of character, dedication, commitment, leadership, and excellence, both in the classroom and in athletic competition, and most importantly, in their everyday life. The recipient of this award has been a highly competitive athlete at Thornridge. She has ranked number three in the class of 2020 and will be graduating with a 4.7 grade point average. The winner of the 2020 George S. McNally Sportsmanship Award is Egbe Onegama.
The Lyndall S. Beckham Award honors Ms. Beckham for her 25 years of service on the Thornton Township High School, District 205 Board of Education. It is awarded to the graduate who has demonstrated excellence in the area of fine arts, which includes instrumental and vocal music, visual arts, speech, media studies, theater, and foreign language. This year's winner has demonstrated outstanding achievement both in and outside the classroom. This year's winner is ranked number four in the class of 2020 and has a 4.6 grade point average. The 2020 winner of the Lindell S. Beckham Fine Arts Award is Umu Samake. The Henry Vandenberg Award honors its namesake, who served on the Thornton Township High School District 205 Board of Education for over 30 years. This honor is bestowed each year upon the graduate who most typifies and demonstrates excellence in academics, extracurricular, community service, character, citizenship, and other qualities that make an outstanding young adult. This student is a true fit for the Vandenberg Award as she demonstrates excellence in academics, extracurricular, community service, character, and citizenship. This graduating senior has a grade point average of 3.3 on a 4.0 scale and is ranked number 38 in the class of 2020. The winner of the 2020 Henry Vandenberg Award is Brielle Jones. The National Association of Students Against Violence Everywhere, SAVE, is a public nonprofit organization. SAVE is a place for young people to show their leadership, creativity, and passion for protecting their friends, school, and communities from violence before it happens. The SAVE Community Scholarship is awarded to the applicant who has performed exceptional community service as a high school student. The recipient of the 2020 SAVE Community Service Scholarship has demonstrated extraordinary service, leadership, and commitment to their school and community. With a 4.26 grade point average, ranking in the top 5% of their class, and with plans of attending the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign, the SAVE organization at Thornridge High School is proud to award Eddie Collins III with this year's SAVE Community Service Scholarship. Good afternoon. I am Dr. Nathaniel Cunningham, Jr., Superintendent of Thornton Township High School District 205. And on behalf of the members of the Board of Education of High School District 205, the District 205 Administration, and the Administration and Faculty of Thornridge High School, I certify that the Class of 2020 has met the requirements for graduation established by the Board of Education of Thornton Township High School District 205. Additionally, I certify that they have also met the requirements for graduation set forth by the Illinois School Code the Illinois State Board of Education, and the Advanced Ed Accreditations. Ms. Graham, members of the Board of Education, and to all those in observation, let it be known that the class of 2020 is hereby declared eligible to receive their diplomas, signifying graduation from Thornridge High School. Congratulations, graduates. This is Ms. Ferguson, College and Career Counselor at Thornridge High School. It is my absolute honor to introduce the top 10 graduates of the class of 2020. Our number 10 graduate is Kishay Driver. She graduates with a 4.16 grade point average and will enlist in the Air Force. Congratulations, Kishay, job well done. Our number nine graduate is Eddie Collins III. He will graduate with a 4.26 grade point average and will attend the University of Illinois. Congratulations, Eddie. Our number eight graduate 
is Maya Norwood. She will graduate with a 4.31 grade point average and will attend Howard University. Congratulations, Maya. Our number seven graduate is Blossom Ukwadeli. She will graduate with a 4.4 GPA and will be starting out at South Suburban and then transfer to U of I. Congratulations, Blossom. Our number six graduate is Yesania Diaz. Yesania will graduate with a 4.42 GPA and will go on to achieve greatness. Congratulations, Ms. Diaz. Our number five graduate is Sonia Bradley. Sonia will graduate with a 4.52 grade point average and will attend the University of Illinois in Urbana. Congratulations, Ms. Sonia. Our number four graduate is Umu Somaki. Umu will graduate with a 4.56 GPA and will attend Illinois State. Congratulations! Our number three graduate is Ekbi Anagami. She will graduate with a 4.66 GPA and will be attending the University of Illinois in Urbana. Congratulations, Ekbi. Our number two graduate is Kaya Opera. Kaya will graduate with a 4.72 GPA and will attend the University of Illinois in Urbana. Congratulations. And our number one graduate is Nafimi Taiwo. She will graduate with a 4.73 GPA and will attend San Xavier University. Congratulations to all of our students. Job well done. We are all extremely proud of you. Thank you. Keyshawn Adams. Sinq Alexander. Keenan Alexander. Michael Alexander. Jayla Ali. Nakaya Ammons. David Anderson. Keandre Anderson. Tatiana Anthony. Jatira Armstrong. Amari Arajojoy. Kayla Bailey. Tahara Banks Blackwell. Layton Battle. Jarvis Bell Jr. Emmanuel Binion. Stephen Blount. Destiny Bowens. J. 
Justice Bolden. Marsalis Batley. Angel Briggs. Juan Brown. Shamari Brown. Julius Brown Jr. Winter Bruce Joshua Burford Aaron Burton Kobe Calhoun. Mario Carr. Luis Carrillo Sarinana. Angelina Chambers. Monty Christopher. Justin Clark. Michael Clay Brown. Latara Coleman. Tyra Cooley. Charles Copeland. Marquan Cotton. Nikio Dickerson. Javante Doby. Antone Dotson. Kyrell Dowdy Riley. Jessica Downs. Lauren DeBose. Talia Dunmars. Daniel Hector. Reginald Edwards, Jr. Nian Lola Agbayeme.
Tatiana Ellis. Tyshawn Estes. Kayla McNeil. Xavier Neal. Clifton Smith III. Carly Stevenson. Aaliyah Tolar. Rod Sean Figures. Lanelle Foster. Clinique Freeman. Jamira Freeman. Katara Funches. Dejan Gilly. Damarion Gray. Leilani Gray. Aaliyah Grayson. Quincy Green. Reginald Green. Danielle Green. Joe Gregorio Flores. Jada Griffin. Kelly Griffin. Markeisha Griggs. Floyd Hill. Satea Hale Grant Hall To yet Hardiman Marshawn Hargrove. Summer Hawkins. Davia Hodges.
Dante Holly. India, Hash. Ronald, Hoskin. Alicia, Hubbard. Hudson, Jr. Shayla, Hunter. Stacy, Ifa Bume. Adonica, Inye, Tam. Ruby, Jacinto. Bobby, Jackson. Javante Jackson. Isaiah Jarrett. Jada Jenkins. Omari Jennings Demia Johnson Eric Johnson Kobe Johnson Rodney Johnson Raniel Jones Jayla Jones Jayla Jones Genesis Jones Catrell Jones Krishan Jones Kaylin Joyner City Medibo Kane Kyra Kennedy Ryan Kennedy Anaya Kimmins
Malik, King. Nicholas, Knight. Isaiah, J. Lambert. Brittany, Lane. Darrell, Lawless. Nevada, Lawrence. Amaya Lee. Daniel Lee. Carl Lerma. Lakeisha Lewis. Heaven Loud. Mariana Love Griggs. Jamel Martin. Kayvon Martin. Ariana Martin Hill. Antonio Mason Nakira King Kara Atkins Sierra Bennett Kiva Boom Keandre Carter Michelle Carter Dejanae Collins Dejan Edwards Janaya Franklin McCullough. Mytel Fryer. Shalee Hart. Malik Henderson. Maya Hooper. Anaya Hurst.
Kara Jackson. Eric Johnson. Jahari Johnson. Jordan Johnson. Ahmad Jadon Armani Kennedy Selena Lang Jawan Livingston Antonia Luckin Brad Martin Anaya McBride Kiara McClain Pierre McClain Jada McClam Daviana McGee Jalen McGregor McKinnis Makaya McMullen Juan McDoza Amari Miller Michael Miller Jr. Corey Milliner Aaliyah Mitchell Maurice Mitchell Amber Montgomery Samaya Moon Nicholas Moore Michael Muti Deja Miles Talon Miles
Michaela Nelson. Kobe Newton. Avanti Nichols. Raheem Parr. Aaliyah Pearson. Lorenzo Perry. Ferrante Robertson Fisher. Erica Ross. Jayla Simmons. Tierra Smith. Taylor Turner. Terrence Weary. Caitlin Williams. Justin Williams. Malia Williams. Nina Williams. Natika William Sanders. Christina Wilson. Mikael Wingard. Jasmine Winton. Tariq Perryman. Lamar Pollard Jr. Jalen Porter. Jordan Pulley. Imani Ray. Jayana Rich. Anthony Rich. Fatima Riley. Thomas Riley. Rachel Robinson.
Michaela Ross. Dynasty Rycroft. Nick Nelly St. Pierre. Justin Shield. Darjan Smith. Jonathan Solorio. Christopher Stewart. Kalir Sweely. Cheyenne Talmadge. Marche Thomas. Azia Walker Asia Washington Storm Washington Watkins Cortez Webb Stephen White Wilkerson Giovanna Williams Jessaria Williams Tyrone Williams Thomas Wellis Ashanti Wilson Tyreek Wooden Jamal Woods Bethany Woodson Graduates, please stand. Would you move your tassels from the right side of your cap to the left side of your cap? Ladies and gentlemen, I proudly present the Thorn Ridge High School graduating class of 2020. Congratulations to all of you.